Well, we all know we've been there carrying around that overloaded camera bag. We know that carrying a ton of stuff just isn't fun. And sometimes it's nice to liberate oneself from that ball and chain we call our camera bag. It seems that whenever I take anything out of the bag to make it lighter, I ended up replacing that spot with something even heavier than I had taken out. Well, this past holiday season is a case in point because due to the generosity of some loved ones, I was able to go buy the new 16mm f1.4 Sigma. And I figured, well, that would replace the kit lens I said I'd never get rid of, as well as my 12mm Rokinon. And, uh, well, that didn't last long because uh, the new Mavic Air drone came out, and so uh, that went right into that empty space. It's kind of crazy how many times I'll end up going out with my huge camera bag and using only one of the lenses in there. So, what if I only took one lens and left the bag at home? Well, let's see what happens on this episode of Chosen Idea. Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of this thing I call Chosen Idea. For those of you who've been here before, you know my name is Marco and I'm a creative generalist. All that means is I've been lucky enough to get paid to do a bunch of creative stuff throughout my career. I've learned some things along the way and now it's my chance to pass those things along to you guys. Well, in this episode, I am doing what's called a um, one lens challenge. I'm going to go out uh, leaving my camera bag at home and take only one lens with me. A little background on where I'm going. I've loved cars since I was a little kid. My dad and I used to work on cars throughout my teenage years and into my early 20s. Every once in a while we still work on cars. As a family we'd go to car shows together because my mother and sister loved cars too. My friends were all into cars as well. I was lucky enough throughout my professional career to work on some automotive accounts like Jaguar, Ford, Land Rover, Mercedes, Nissan, most recently uh, Volkswagen. I've even had a chance to work on the design of an electric sports car that nobody ever got to see. About a dozen images showed a very modern looking car. Well, lucky for me, my girlfriend is almost into cars as much as I am. And today we are going to the Canadian International Auto Show. So we've got a beautiful day outside today. And we're finally taking off. I say finally because it's taken forever to get ready. Finally taken off. And today I get to try my new 16mm Sigma F1.4. I haven't been able to even touch it since I got it for Christmas. So super excited about that. It's going to be the one lens challenge today. See what I can do with this one lens. All right. See you then. So we're finally on our way. Look, yeah. we can see ourselves in the lens. <laughs> yeah, that's cool.
there you have it, an entire day free of lugging around a huge camera bag. And it was all done with one lens, and in this case, that new Sigma 16mm f1.4. Now you don't have to go out and spend money on an expensive lens to get these kind of results. Any fast-ish wide-angle lens would have been just fine. And if you're shooting with a gimbal like me, preferably it would be a lens with decent autofocus as well. If you're not proficient with using manual focus and a gimbal. Now going to some shoots with only one lens can kind of be like asking someone to play an entire game of golf with only one club. Well, the auto show isn't like that. It's more like knowing you're bringing your putter because you're going to play the hole in one game on The Price is Right. I knew I'd be fighting crowds all day, so I'd have to get really close to the cars. Getting really close to the cars would mean I'd have to have a lens wide enough I can get an entire car in a frame at that distance. Now, if I were to choose a second lens, it'd probably be a long lens because then I could get up on one of the balconies at the auto show and shoot down. Again, avoiding any of the crowds. Challenge yourself today to leave that camera bag at home and see what you can do with just one lens. If you choose to subscribe to this channel, you'll receive email notifications whenever I post new videos. If you found this um, video entertaining or useful, please hit that like button. If you've got ideas for future show ideas, please put those in the comments below. And remember, keep working to make your chosen idea a reality. And until next time, peace. All this cold weather and people driving their winter beaters around, I can't wait to see some exotics today. <laughs>